Hey, right, you guys, I'm going to show you how to set up your Xfinity XB8 modem. I uh, just took it out. The box that it came in, as you see, they give you a little cable right here. They give you a power cord right here. Go in the back. They give you an Ethernet cord. And then, you know, of course, instructions right here to get it all hooked up. Here's the actual modem right here. Check it out. Woo! Nice little top, tall. I've got the XB6 now, you know, the black one. This is smooth so i think it's a little taller than i went on the back as you can see this is the xb 8-t model and the one thing i noticed is that it's got four ethernet ethernet jacks two phone jacks right there there's for the cable line there's a usb plug and there's your power right there so we're going to bring this thing over here we're going to hook it up and get it all set up show you guys how to do it this is the old xb6 modem right here as you can see it only has two uh, two Ethernet jacks, the, the phone jacks here, and then power, no USB plug here. And the other thing is that the air, the uh, the, the vent is on the back versus the vent being on the front of the new one. The vent is on the back there. All right, you guys, I'm going to unplug the, uh, the, uh, the six. This is the six, so this is old, baby. As you see, the six only has the two Ethernet jacks, two phone jacks right here. So we're going to take all this loose. do i'm gonna just hold this here's your cable wire right here you want to unscrew that and on the back of your new one right here you want to put it in you can put it in at either one but i'm going to put actually the ethernet that one in one phone line up top in that one and then you want to screw the cable line right in there so there's the cable line i'm going to screw that in next thing you, get, you take your power, your power cord, one end goes here, and then let me take a loose all my other stuff, take that off, take the old baby out, and don't, don't worry about what's back here. We just gonna, because everybody's got their own little stash of wires, y'all already know. So once we take that wire out, all right, you guys, once you plug it up, you see the lights right here. You're waiting on the lights to change over, and then it'll be set for activation. Make sure you return your old modem to it, uh, you know, to the office. Either mail it in to get you a, a self-mail label or take it right to a little office. As you can see, it'll start flashing right here. Basically, it's looking for the signal so it can lock in on the uh, doxes. So you, it'll, it'll start flashing nets. All right, next thing you guys want to do is sign into your Xfinity app. Once you get to uh, your Xfinity app, go to account, and then right here it says activate my X5 gateway or modem. Then you choose uh, your X5 gateway. And once it loads up, I'm actually on my Wi-Fi. I should come off my Wi-Fi. But I'm going to stay on my Wi-Fi. I see how it works. Time to get your new gateway up and running. Let's get set up. And right here, it says it should take no longer than 20 minutes. It says get started. Okay, identify your gateway. Use the camera. So let me stop this for a minute. I don't want you guys to see my, my numbers. Right, once you scan uh, your serial number underneath the bottom of your modem, it tells you about returning your old device. Connect. It says connect the co coaxial cable. It says, you know, make sure you put this in a centralized location. So you put it in a centralized location, you maximize your Wi-Fi, then you connect the coax cable, which should already be connected, and uh, connect the phone line. So let me show you guys. And then it says you power it up. So let me show you guys that real quick. And now back on the app, you hit ready to go. Let's check your connection. Make sure your power cord is plugged in. And your coax cable is connected to an active outlet. Then you say check your connection here. Please hold tight. It says we're looking for your gateway. Estimated time could take up to four minutes. And once I come back, the light has now turned green. I'll show you guys that in a minute. It's going from green to white. It's flashing from green to white. So right now we're looking, so let's do that.
you guys i put my information in and i said getting ready to set up it's going to take a i said don't unplug it it's going to take about 10 minutes so i'm gonna let you guys see what it's looking like but i'm not gonna hold y'all for 10 minutes we'll be right back after these messages if you get this message right here that means you have to wait till all the updates have stopped and you want to wait until the light turns green and then try again it's still updating guys i'm running a quick little test got everything set up i did have to test uh support because uh it didn't uh, activate uh automatically through the app so they had to activate it manually so i'm running just a little speed test right now just to see what we got hook it into the new wi-fi test speed for your gateway they say it may take up to 60 seconds so let's see what we got here on our new x5 sb8 let's go oh, we have some smoking speeds here let's see what we got here let's see what's cracking on here yeah pretty simple to set up just uh you know you couldn't do everything with the app but it was a quick text message they got back with me in like two minutes and probably took them maybe maybe five minutes Maybe 10 minutes all together because it had to go through a couple of updates and everything. So I'm going to show you. I'm going to wait for this speed test to finish. And just see what we got. We're going to get a screen that says secure your network. Turn on your S5Y security uh, for added layer. Let me make sure here's a... Turn on your S5 advanced security for added layer protection for your network connected devices when a threat is tested. So we're going to turn that on. And I'm going to get back with y'all because I got to name my system. All right, you guys, that we are finished. We all set up. I just connected to online. That's what you want to see. You want to see a solid white line on the modem once everything is done, connected. Oh, yeah, it's getting, I feel, I feel a little warm right here already. But they got the air holes up here. But that's what you want to see, a solid white line. You're all set. You're back online. You got the smoking speeds. You're good to go. And that's how you set up your, your XB8 X5 Xfinity. Mode. See you on the next video.